Today, we'll be looking at my brand new travel companion. Right off the bat, oh, I'm not even, am I recording? Oh. This is the little wireless controller by PDP. That's the actual name. They got right to the point. Th this thing is pretty small. Yeah, it stands up to the name. I know a lot of you guys are probably thinking, am I able to have like a, a long extended playthrough with this controller? It's so small, it's so compact. How are my hands not gonna get cramped while playing this? Don't let the size of this thing fool you. This thing is a lot more comfortable than you think. This thing fits in the palm of my hands flawlessly. That is because of the shape. The wishbone style shape of this controller is the reason why it fits so well in my hands, man. It just curves in perfectly. It's a solid fit. The curve of the triggers is another reason why this thing is so comfortable. The curve to the triggers themselves add even more comfort. It's like your fingers were meant to fit there. The back plate also has a grip texture. Although it's not rubber, there's a bunch of little dots embedded into the plastic to create a grip feel. The joysticks, however, do have rubber grips. Most PDP controllers have this type of texture for their control sticks, and it's really become a staple of their design. I've said it before, and I'll say it again, PDP has the joysticks down, man. They're smooth. The D-pad is also pretty solid. There's a bit of a curve, it kind of curves up and out, which makes it easier to press and more precise. The A, B, X, Y buttons also have a type of dome formation to them. They're more rounded at the front, which makes it easier and smoother to transition between them. It is true, there is no there is no rumble or NFC amiibo functionality. However, to make up for it, you've got motion control and a 40 hour battery. You can charge this with a USB-C connection. So the same connection that you use for your Switch, the same that I use for my phone, and every electronic device that I have. Straight up, this controller is meant for gaming on the go. This is a perfect controller to fit in a backpack and take on the go with you. It is so much easier just to take this thing out of your backpack than to fumble with your Joy-Cons, taking them off of your system, getting the whole thing set up. No, you don't have to worry about that. You've got this bad boy. However, I am not really traveling anywhere these days, and with good reason. <laughs> Knowing that I'm not traveling or commuting or anything like that, I'm starting to see this thing as not just a controller, but a remote. Is that weird? That's just what I've gotten from this. I don't just see this as an on-the-go controller. I see this as a durable, compact, comfortable controller that I could put in my bedside table and not worry about it taking up much space. Instead of a big, hefty pro controller, you can have almost all of those major features, but in a bite-sized package like this one. I prefer this over my Joy-Con. There, I said it. I don't need to fumble around taking those things off. I'll just use this. It's that simple. It's that convenient, easy to bring around, efficient on battery life. What, what more can you ask for with a controller this size? If you want to check this controller out for yourself, I'll be posting the link in the description below. If you guys enjoyed the video, consider dropping a like and commenting with your thoughts on this controller in the comments below. Again, thank you so, so much to my friends at PTP Gaming for sending over this controller. I'm extremely grateful and I'm, I'm, I'm so happy I got to check this out for myself. This thing is awesome. If you hold down the home button, it activates your switch. It's that simple. Okay, no, my switch is actually on. Wait. <laughs>